The Russian company is working on several drone systems, heavy and medium class, for both attack and reconnaissance drones. Russia has also tested the flight of two unmanned aerial vehicles, the 6-ton Altius U reconnaissance drone and the 20-plus ton Okhotnik stealth drone Hunter for a year now. Warzone contributor Thomas Nudik believes he already knows the main role of Russia's Okhotnik heavy attack drone, and said the UAV, the UAV will be a wingman for the fifth generation Suhoi Su-57 fighter, will likely function as a weapons carrier, assisting the Su-57 with advanced standalone capabilities. The Russian Defense Ministry has previously claimed the Okhotnik will extend the range of its radar, Su-57, and provide target acquisition to use air-launched weapons. If true, this suggests that the drone could be used to signal long-range weapons against air and ground targets on behalf of the Su-57, serving as a loyal wingman-type complement to the aircraft. This also implies that the drone will be equipped with sensors that will allow it to detect, track and hit aerial targets, Nudik said. With this in mind, it is also possible that the drone could strike aerial targets with its own weapons, although the degree of autonomy involved in such a process is unclear. However, the emerging capability of the Okhotnik to carry missiles on its own will lead it to a future role as a weapons carrier for the Su-57, increasing the arsenal available to combat aircraft and potentially deterring enemy manned fighters and other threats. The drone can be armed with upgraded short-range R-73 and R-74M missiles, as well as new K-74M2 missiles, with the latter said to have post-launch lock-on capability these missiles have a range of between 30 and 40 kilometers. The Okhotnik may also be capable of carrying medium-range air-to-air missiles such as the R-77, R-77-1, and K-77M, having a range of 80 to 200 kilometers. Okhotnik made its maiden flight in August 2019, on a drone, also known as the Suhoi S-70, designed by the Suhoi Design Bureau, maker of the Su-57. The drone is said to be made from advanced composite materials and coatings to make it, practically invisible to radar, and is equipped with a wide range of equipment for optoelectric, radio-based and other reconnaissance. The Okhotnik drone reportedly weighs more than 20 tons, has a wingspan of 19 meters, and uses the same AL-31 series engines found on the Suhoi Su-27 fighters. The Okhotnik drone is also said to have a flight range of up to 3,500 kilometers, and a flight capability of up to 920 kilometers per hour, although it is unclear how its weapon load would affect these characteristics. In August 2020, developers revealed several other Russian unmanned aerial vehicle design candidates, including the 7-ton Grom Thunder combat support aircraft for the Su-35 and Su-57, and Helios radar surveillance and guidance drones. This weapon is made by the developer of unmanned air systems, Kronstadt Group. The company is also working on other platforms, namely the Sirius, a 2-ton long-range reconnaissance and combat UAV.